this is Martez, and we are here again at What's Your Wi-Fi, curated by Molly Soda and NewHive.com. And what, really what we have here is a new experience that a lot of cats from Detroit and around the world are taking into their own hands. This is a do-it-yourself art venue um, showcasing a few different internet artists and some crazy, crazy projects that they have going on all around the world. So shit, we're here at North End Studios, Detroit, Michigan. Let's check it out. Well, I put together a bunch of digital work, uh, all made on newhive.com. It's kind of like a self-publishing net art platform. So all of the pieces have that in common. They're all digital, and all the artists are from all over. All um, over the world, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I have an artist from London, one from France. I think one of them is from Australia, so it's pretty cool. We are here with Luna Jackson of Prism Views. She is one of the leading visual artists doing some of the craziest projects in all of Metro Detroit. She actually and her production team, Prism Views, they've done visuals for internationally renowned artist Jimmy Edgar on his stints back home and they had a collective of esteemed artists from CCS an art school here in Detroit that has been the alma mater to many, many, many artists abroad. Luna Jackson. And Jello actually is quite the esteemed musician out of Michigan. A couple places elsewhere too, you know what I mean? So Mr. Jello, aka Barbecue, please tell me, what is your art medium? Uh, my art medium is uh, field recorded beats and uh, fucked up scary ink drawings. I've been writing beats on uh, a Game Boy Advance lately and that shit's dope as fuck. It's like FM synthesis on a Game Boy. Damn. So, Wait. been writing some like deep like footwork cuts and like deep house glitch joints. That's been my main shit. And that's popping as fuck, and I've been digging the fuck out of it. Where can we find your shit right now? Uh, BBQ Chirps, like, like you chirping on a bird, dot com. BBQ Chirps dot com. And then there's like a SoundCloud zone right at the bottom of like some scary looking picture of me, and then another one of me right at the bottom of it. Uh, and then there's just like a link zone. Bet. And it sounds fucking rad. We about to check that shit out in a minute. How would you say, rather, the internet has helped you in your career so far? Um, well, the internet is just like this, like, crazy, like, place that has, I mean, it's completely new frontier for art. Completely new frontier for art. And, like, Molly Soda has been, like, one of the most, like, prominent, like, artists for the internet. Standard for to media that I'm using right now, it's like with my like use of photography, like I'm totally invested in print media still. But I think that what's emerging with photo not with photography, but also with uh, web-based media and distribution is super exciting, especially for up-and-coming artists. And that it's like it's a platform where we can everybody can be reached so much easier. You can get yourself out there so much quicker. You're not limited by a curator or a writer or something like that. It's like so much easier to exist in the underground now. And being yeah, being on the net is like it's so important right now. Like it, that's how you meet other artists. You see new work. You stay current and you keep moving forward.